or take it out. Well, I said, I ain't got to think about that. Let's get rid of it. I don't nothing like it me hanging around. Well, as soon as I made that decision, here come that fear. I mean, just tormenting me, day and night, day and night for like two weeks. And, you know, she still got a job, works at home, so I wasn't going to give in to that fear. But she had to have some sleep. So I'd go out in the garage. I'd just walk around that garage, just march, singing songs. Praising God, worshiping God, because I made up my mind. The devil said, you'll never get up off that operating table. And I made up my mind, I'd rather die on that operating table than I had to give in to something come to you, you low down dog. Yeah. Praise yes, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Three or four days before I go to the operating room, my pastor was having Monday night prayer meeting. And he said, Brother Dodd, is it okay if I tell everybody where everybody can pray for you? I said, yes, sir. The more prayer I get, the better. Well, Sister Duke, she spoke in tongues and then gave the interpretation. And the interpretation was, I am the great physician. I will be in that operating room with you. And I'm standing here today. I'm cancer negative. Thank you, Lord. I'm the great physician. Don't Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Well, I guess I'm ready now. And if you would stand for the reading of the word.